<clears throat> hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a general pick a pile reading about your crush's sex energy. This will include a card for their energy, their energy blocks, their good vibe number one, good vibe number two, and are they feeling sexy? Readings are timeless, timestamps are in the pinned comments, and decks are in the description box. There's also a link to Instagram for free layouts. Also, I started doing each of these layouts is available on Etsy as a personalized reading. So if you're watching the video and none of them seem to fit for you because you have a really unique circumstance, you can get one personalized. And currently they're only $7.77, so that's also a really good price for an individual reading. If the camera zooms in, we will pull a clarifier from the Tarot of Sexual Magic. We also have what's in the box. What's in the box is to help you with your intuition and intuition is really important on my channel if I say something like oh you know you're gonna get a divorce and you're not even married then you know that that information is not for you and you either need to pick another pile or do an individual reading so today we have the gun the atom and then we have a Aries little silver pendant thing so we will go ahead and get started we're going to use the gun first so we have what is their energy the energy blocks good vibe number one good vibe number two and are they feeling sexy all right so their overall energy is pulling up as strategy so strategy is all about plans it's all about um like especially if there's this is their sex energy it's like they see something that they want Quite possibly for some of you, it is you. It is a sex relationship with you. I feel like the people in this group have not had sex at this point and they're just trying to, you know, see how things would go. So their sexual energy block is pulling, pulling up as the five of pentacles. And this is like a poverty mindset. This is about worry. Some of them, uh, they are worried about money and that's just kind of made it so they're not even thinking about sex. But then some of them, the block is that they don't know that you like them. That's why they're in a strategy place. Because they're trying to figure out if they should make the first move, if you're going to make the first move. You know, they're just as lost as you are in this situation. So the good vibe number two is showing up as Knight of Wands. And the Knight of Wands is a passionate person, free-spirited. And like I said, these can be male or female tarot readings are not gender specific. So, you know, the other thing I notice in this one is, you know, they're, they're naked on the horses. They're riding. I don't know if you can really see that they're riding bareback naked. <laughs> so, I mean, this person really could have some energetic, you know, their good vibe is that they're just really free and open and passionate and that's probably why you're attracted to them or drawn to them just because they feel really good all right there's a motorcycle outside and the good vibe number two is pulling up as the three of wands and the three of wands is about teamwork and expansion you know this person really is working on themselves i feel like a lot of them have been you know eating healthier and losing weight we also really don't have any major arcana in here. So this relationship, you know, it's just getting started. Um, it's at like the top of the hill for the snowball. Like nothing has gotten really big in this situation. Uh, you guys kind of have like a little crush on them and you just wanted to know what things would be like sexually. And um, they are in a place of growth. They're in a place of getting more comfortable with, them, with themselves so that when they're ready for a sexual relationship, they just feel comfortable in it. So then are they feeling sexy shows up as no, heck no. You know, it's a bad idea. You can tell with your intuition that it won't work. Go a different route. So this person is not feeling sexy, but I believe that the reason, they, it says the reason they're not feeling sexy is because they don't feel that they have completed their whole plan. So like I said, some of them are losing weight and they're getting their finances in order and they just don't feel that they are currently ready for a sexual relationship. All right. Well, I would love to hear what was going on with their energy. And if you kind of have noticed they're losing weight or if you feel that that doesn't really match for your situation, you can either look at one of the other piles or go check out the Etsy shop for an individual reading for your unique situation. 
And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and all the wonderful things you can do on YouTube. And don't forget to go to the end of the video for what is in the box. All right, so this is for group number two, which shows the atom. We have their energy, their sexual energy blocks. We have their good vibe one, good vibe two, and are they feeling sexy? All right, so this is, oh, a woman holding a heart. That's awesome energy. Now, in tarot and readings like this, especially my intentionality is that they are not gender specific. So there you might be thinking about a man and the woman holding a heart card is coming up because every human being has masculine and feminine energy. So there's a feminine part of them that is, um, so like the, the feminine side is more passive. It's more the receiving mode. So this person is really in just kind of like a go with the flow feeling sexually. They're not really making any advances on anything. Uh, but they're willing to go forward if the, the opportunity presents itself. So I feel like um, both of you have been sexually active, but not together. So their sexual energy block is pulling up as the wheel. And the wheel is like good fortune or a turning point. So what's blocking them is they either feel like they have been unlucky in love or that they really don't deserve love and it's it's blocking them and as you can see like in the picture there's like three different naked women there's like so many options but they don't see any options so then their good vibe number one though is pulling up as the seven of wands i'll go ahead and show you that the seven of wands is about self-defense it's about um not having any competitors like they're they are really sexy to you you don't really feel like anybody compares to them. And there's a lot of people that feel that same way. This person has a very charismatic sexual energy. Uh, then secret number two. Wow, it's kind of cool. They both have those same like backless dresses. And this is the five of swords. And the five of swords is about bullies and abusive relationships. So they have this good vibe because they are aren't that. Does that make any sense? So they have the opposite of this quality. They're probably one of the nicest people you've ever met. Hmm. So then, uh, do they feel sexy is pulling up as no, not possible. It's out of your hands. The universe says this goes against your life's purposes and goals. At this time, this person is not meant to feel sexy. Uh, this person, it's interesting because holding a heart, this person is they're looking for a soulmate. They're not looking for somebody who they're just having sex with. They're looking for somebody who they feel could really be a part of their life. And so they're not really feeling sexy right now because they're not just in a purely sexual thought process. All right. Well, I look forward to hearing in your comments what was going on. And if you feel that you need an individual um, reading because yours is so specific, you can either check out the other pick a piles or go and find the link to the Etsy reading as there's one available. Also, don't forget to like and share and subscribe and all the wonderful things you can do on YouTube. And don't forget to go to the end of the video for what is in the box. And this is for the third group, for the people who chose Aries. This is your crush's energy. This is their energy blocks. Good vibe one, good vibe two. And are they feeling sexy? So their overall energy is patience. Ah. So some of you are currently in relationships. And you have a crush on them, but you're kind of scared to get out of the relationship that you're in. And this person is patiently waiting for the good thing in their life. So what's blocking them from good sex is the moon. And the moon is about unseen problems. They don't really know what's going on. They don't know what's blocking them. They, um, they do. They see you with other people. Both of these couples are, are together. Like there's two couples here. So I kind of feel like, a little bit, I sense that either maybe both of you are in relationships and that's what's making this difficult. So you kind of have a crush on them and you wanted to know what their sex energy is, but it's not really available. And that's what's like blocking the sex between the two of you. 
So their good sex vibe number one is the fool. So the fool is the beginning of the journey. It's fresh hope. It's taking chances. It's the beginning of something. So this person, um, it's really interesting. It's like they're patiently waiting for something to start. But also in this, they are alone and there's people in the background having sex. So they might be thinking about breaking up in the relationship that they're currently in. And yet you are still in another relationship or vice versa. But I feel that this specifically is you in another relationship. And then their second vibe is showing up as the eight of pentacles. The eight of pentacles is about mastering your craft, getting to the top of your class. But I also see that, you know, she's not even looking at him. She's kind of looking at something out off frame and he's trying to offer a rose I feel like both of you are in active relationships at this time with other people. So are they currently feeling sexy? No, under no circumstances. There is no future in this choice. There is no way it will work out in your favor. That's your as in that person. And I feel like this kind of goes back to this. Like they're thinking about um, ending a relationship. So they're not really feeling sexy, which is no reflection on you. Because at this point, it's like they're, they're, not even really noticing because you are in with somebody else. So I would definitely be patient with this person because that's where they are. They're making changes in their life. All right. Well, I would love to hear what's going on with that. And if that didn't meet your specific relationship, you can go ahead and try the other readings or check out Etsy. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and all the wonderful things you can do here on YouTube. Now we're going to go ahead and open the box. What's in the box? in the box and we'll go in five four three two and one and it is the word sing all right guys well i really enjoyed reading for you today and thank you for stopping by and i look forward to reading for you again